Hello, bonjour, comment ça va? My name is Lazius K, and I talk about the practical uses of VR. Woo! That's right. Today, we're going to talk about something really awesome, which is what VR really contributes well towards, which is first aid. How to learn about first aid in VR. Right, let's go. So today we're going to be talking about first aid in VR, which is freaking awesome. This is what VR is all about. Really trying to teach people new skills within a virtual reality environment. So this, however, was meant for the Gear VR. So there are little bugs here and there within this app. But if you are curious about first aid and you have an Oculus Go, I definitely recommend you to check it out. All right, let's go. All right, let's go and check out first aid training app. So what I like about this app uh, is the fact that they have a lot of different exercises, uh, around 13 different exercises, in fact, uh, from introduction to the actual course, to the aims of priorities of first aider, the ABCs, uh, the primary survey, the secondary survey, recovery position, CPR, and so much more. Uh, the other thing is you can actually watch videos as well, uh, and you will have a you'll have a person who will actually narrate everything uh, for you and who will explain every single um, every single exercise before you would actually take on this exercise so if I wanted to learn more about AED I can just watch the video first uh, he will give me an explainer as to what it's for how to use it and those kind of things uh, or for example, if I wanted to know more about CPR, then I can just watch first uh, the video uh, to get some kind of information about how to perform it, how to position my hands, uh, you know, those kind of things. And then of course, the special and unique aspect about this app is you can experience the actual um, exercises itself. So they will actually do some 3D rendering uh, where you have a casualty uh, lying on the floor. Uh, so if you're doing the AED, um, the voice would explain to you what to do. Um, and then you basically follow step by step all the different things. And it's really, really useful because it makes you feel like you're really there and things are really happening because this is something that's really important, you know. These things do happen and at the end of the day it's something that it's best for us to, to learn what is, what is going on. Um, and you know, other experiences, for example CPR, is something that's extremely important. So, um, you know, you, you can actually practice if you don't you know, buy a dummy or you don't have a dummy, of course no one would actually buy a real dummy at home and practice at home. So this is a really good way to bring this kind of app into the workplace. Uh, I can see a lot of good uses, uh, good uses for it. However, unfortunately there are bugs in this app um, and that is because it is not meant for the Oculus Go. It is meant for Gear VR, I believe. Uh, so you will have the 3D uh, there are some exercises where they ask you to repeat certain things. Unfortunately, the wand, the controller, doesn't work. So I'm not able to actually interact or practice this exercise. Uh, the other issues that occur are when you're watching a video. What will happen is when you get to the end of the video, the video will naturally stop playing. It will disappear. But then what will happen is everything else will disappear too. And unfortunately, there's no way to find the buttons anymore. They're all gone. So the only way to continue is to exit the app and then reload the app. So after the app reloads, it resets everything and then everything is back to normal. All right, so we checked out First aid in VR, yes, it is a little bit buggy simply because it's not meant for the Oculus Go, it's meant for Gear VR. So if you have a mobile phone and you have the Gear VR you know, headset, do check it out. 
And, you know, let us know. Leave a comment below. Did it work better for you? I mean, what was the experience like compared to using the Oculus Go? However, I will try to write to the uh, programmers or to the company who created this app so that they can update it in the Oculus Go because it's definitely something that I recommend everyone should at least go into once or twice to learn those kind of valuable, really priceless kind of skills. Uh, you know, we could potentially save a life. I mean, how amazing is that? All right, remember to like and subscribe. Leave a comment below with all your ideas and suggestions so that I can go out and shoot the content for you. That's right. And again, thank you very much for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed yet, come on, you have to subscribe. Just do it. Until next time, take it easy. DJ Q Music.